Coastal Massachusetts bore the brunt of a harsh winter storm that stretched across much of the Northeast and Mid-Atlantic, but even the 70 mile an hour wind gusts didn't deter some locals. Uh, this is by far the worst winter storm I've seen and just the quantity of snow and uh, it, it, it's awesome, love it. Massachusetts governor lifted a travel ban in western counties, but he had strong warnings for those on the eastern side of the state. The drifting continues to be an issue, the blowing. Uh, there are drifts now as high as four, five, six feet uh, in many places. Up the coast in downtown Portland, Maine, a lone cross-country skier braved blinding conditions. Boats docked nearby rocked in strong winds. It was a different story to the south. New Yorkers had been preparing for what they were told would be a storm of historic proportions. Meteorologists say the nor'easter stayed about 75 to 100 miles east of its predicted track while far eastern Long Island saw more than a foot of snow. Crazy, really crazy out here. Conditions in Manhattan were much more favorable. Uh, weather forecasters do the best they can, uh, and we respond to the best information that we have. The massive storm created a ripple effect from Newark. They told me that my flight will be moved to Wednesday. To Atlanta and across the country, flight cancellations were in the thousands. With intense snow still hitting New England, the cleanup could take days. Matt Friedman, Associated Press.